What's going on everybody? Big Ten Ted coming at you here today from snowy, cold, center city, Minnesota, Wild River State Park. Current temperature, whew, negative 14 degrees. We got Big Ten Bridget running the camera uh, here today. So let's talk about last night. Let's talk about Michigan. Okay, that Orange Bowl semifinal. Jim Harbaugh said in his post-game press conference they were not, they weren't ready. No, they, they weren't ready for this one. They weren't ready for Georgia. Georgia was a superior team. Michigan had a great year, uh, but this is what happens when you can't run the ball. This is what happens when Son Haskins, Blake Corum, even Edwards, they can't get anything going running the ball. Right? J.J. McCarthy, one of your top rushers. Maybe he should be quarterback next season. That's something I'm sure I'll talk about in the offseason because he showed a little bit of a spark uh, there in his stat line uh, late in the game. So so Michigan wasn't ready to play. Uh, Georgia just completely and utterly dominated them, and we're going to get an all, oh, geez, we're going to get an all SEC championship game. But a great, you know, fantastic uh, Big Ten football season. we got a lot coming up. Can we cover some Big Ten basketball? Got a request for maybe even some Big Ten baseball? But a lot coming up in 2022. Off-season, 2022 football season is going to be good. These guys might have something to say with what happens in the Big Ten West in 2022. But just wanted to wish everybody a very happy, healthy, safe New Year 2022. Got to get some things figured out on this side of the of the YouTube channel. But we're going to have plenty coming up here in 2022. So make sure you subscribe, all you northern, midwestern football fans. So happy New Year from Center City, Minnesota. Negative 14 degrees, the wildlife, the geese, they're making noise like Michigan did not in the Orange Bowl playoff semifinal on New Year's Eve. We'll see you next time. Big Ten Ted coming from snowy cabin country, Minnesota.